what's good y'all it's your boy ross back at it again with another video so i got some unfortunate news man uh it's been circulating on social media wardlow posted a video of his vehicle being broken into and whoever broke into the vehicle stole literally everything including the tnt championship he just won at revolution and it's it's really unfortunate that that happened to him so we're gonna check out the video that he dropped on his personal account on twitter man and uh see what he had to say and and, and what went down uh it's just it's just unfortunate that you know people can't you know get their own things legitimately they gotta break into people's vehicles and, and steal their stuff it's kind of trash let's check this out well, thanks to the person who broke into my rental car and took absolutely everything from me. My TNT title, my gear, my boots, my whole life uh, were in those bags. Um, I don't know if this means I'm going to have to beat the shit out of Hobbs in these clothes I'm wearing right now. <laughs> but uh, one way or another, I'm going to make it to Sacramento and... Uh, we're gonna get this shit done. Whoever did do this, better thank God that uh, I didn't catch you in the act because your jaw would be as shattered as this glass is. Damn, bro, that's cold. That's cold blooded. I ain't gonna lie to you. That is that's that's truly messed up, bro. Like, imagine you winning the championship, winning the title, or whatnot, getting ready to, you know. You know, get set off to, you know, defend the championship or whatnot this week. Only for it to get stolen with along everything else in your vehicle. By a loser. That's lame. That's that's truly lame. Um, it's unfortunate, too, that that happened to him. Because it, it shows, once again, that, you know, people can't get what they need. You know, get, you know the things that they want to get themselves or they have to take it from somebody else and this is coming from someone that's had their vehicle broken into and i literally had nothing in my car and they just broke into my vehicle because they thought maybe something was in there like it's it's frustrating you know and, and i'm it, it sucks that that happened to him you know and uh hopefully he's able to you know get you know everything replaced and uh, i do not think this is a storyline i do actually think this legitimately happened to him um it would be crazy if it was a storyline, you know what I'm saying? That would be a wild way to set up a, a feud, but I, I think this is a, a legit something that, you know, a messed up individual decided to do. And clearly, they had to have known that was Wardlow's, like, rental vehicle. They had to have known. Because for you to randomly just hit somebody's vehicle, bust out all the windows and steal everything, you had to have known that was that person's vehicle maybe he was followed i'm not sure it's just really unfortunate it's it's truly unfortunate that people will resort to these type of things to steal out of somebody's car steal someone's possessions and if you're one of those individuals that know people like that you know or you you know you've done that in the past you know what i'm saying hey bro that shit's not cool it's it's people work hard for the things that they get and they shouldn't you know have to worry about replacing their stuff so hopefully warlow's able to replace everything you know saying glad you know it was a situation where you know she maybe it would have been <laughs> maybe it, it sh maybe he should have been out there maybe to give give the guy uh give the guy a combo piece but at the same time we don't know if they were armed or not so i'm glad no one was hurt but to those to those criminals out there, man, you're gonna get yours. Karma's gonna get you when you least expect it, man. So comment down below. Let me know. Have you guys ever had a situation where your car gotten broken into, and you know you had a minor setback because you know people just don't know how to get it on their own. You know, let me know down below, and um, we can have that discussion. But hopefully, Warlow is able to get you know another obviously another replacement title and and kind of recover some of those things that he lost um um and kind of move forward from this situation but i wanted to talk about this give my you know a little two cents on it to criminals out there you guys suck and you guys are the worst but i appreciate all love and support roll to 150k i'm still young speedy youtube wrestling champ of the world and also in the clutch world heavyweight champion appreciate y'all giving me see y'all next one peace